Hello everybody, hope you are doing well. Access Football 2023 has released and we're gonna check out some gameplay real quick. I'm not sure why it says Access 21 on the on the uh, menu right there, but yeah. It is 23, See the player models a little bit, okay. Pretty similar, I recognize what we're looking at here. They said they added a lot of animations for catching and throwing and so on. Honestly, I'm not in tune with every little change. I'm just gonna tell you how it feels and so on. Welcome football fans to Cleveland Ohio. I'm Dave Stevens and analyst Mike Steele is in the booth with me as always. Thanks Dave. I'm particularly excited for today's matchup. I just have a feeling that it's going to be a special game. You know I couldn't agree more Mike. It'll certainly be exciting to see how things unfold today Mike. All right first off the field looks really good. It looks better than I think the previous game unless memory's not serving me correct but it looks pretty good. You also got a little bit of a touch of the announcers. I left them on for this Lucas portion. Lucas kicks it off. Black takes the kickoff. And he's brought down after a return of 24. All right, on that first tackle, it does look like they go through each other a little the bit, but I felt like there was a little bit more weight to 34. it. After a flag this. on the play. Oh, okay. We had a penalty against the offense. Tennessee takes the penalty. So many penalties are just mental mistakes. Um, after this first play or two, I'm going to turn off the announcer so I can talk to you a little bit more normal. I wanted you just to uh, be able to hear him for a little bit, though. All right, there's the motion that was added to the game. The QB hands it off. Oh, that was a new that was a new animation. A little dip off to the side, I think. A good first down for the defense is an incomplete pass or a short run, not another first down. I guess they didn't get the memo. All right, I turned the announcers off. They don't really have too much to add, and they, I don't believe they were changed too much from last game. So if you knew them well, uh, it looks like you're getting the same thing. You can leave them on if you want. But for me, talking, let's have it off. Field, like I said, looks pretty good. Stadiums look similar but improved maybe a little bit. I know they added to the lighting system a little, and you can tell with the shadows and so on. I think maybe that's what's making the field look a little better, honestly. It has been a minute since I've played this. I played a lot of the last one. We had a series going for a little while. But it just felt too easy. Uh, so I'm interested to see what the offense feels like uh, once we get out here. I am on all-star difficulty. So take that as you will. There's one more step up. I think it's Hall of Fame difficulty or something like that. But I just wanted to jump in and at least get a little bit of a look at the gameplay. So you saw a little bit of the motion so far. That's a, a new addition. Ooh, the quarter's already, <laughs> already over. So they're breaking tackles a lot more than I remember the AI. It seems like they're they're getting away from me a little bit. That's good to see. And they are moving the ball. I mean, I'm a little out of practice, not going to lie, but they are moving the ball. Let's see what this uh we got that motion going on. All right, I broke through the line. Team strategy, you got the balance, defend pass and so on. We can shift players. So, okay, so if you hold it down, you can tell them to shift around. So that's cool. That's actually really nice. I don't know if that was always there or if that's new. But because uh, I know the offense got a lot of uh, motions and so on. Ooh, bad pass by the QB there. But you can shift around the defense. I, don't, I think that's new. I don't remember that being in the last game unless I was just absolutely not paying attention. All right, let's see if they can get out of this precarious situation. Doesn't look like it. Fourth and five, so let's get the field goal team out there. And I'm excited to try out the offense, see what that feels like. The throwing is, apparently has been changed. There we go. Goodbye, football. And now we are going to get a chance to finally touch the football as they kick it out of the end zone. Let's get on offense. All right, we're in a single back. Uh, my tradition is always to run off to the right. It's a halfback toss. I usually like to hand this off. But let's see what this feels like on the ground. I don't know what kind of... Uh, I don't want, know what kind of running back we have or not. Actually, let me see what 
so many controls here. Juke right, juke left. Speed burst is on the right. Okay. I have to retrain myself because I've been playing Legend Bowl a lot. We have a franchise mode series going on over there. So if, if you're interested in that, subscribe. Uh, if I enjoy this, we'll, we'll probably do a series eventually in this as well. Uh, let's see what the passing game would feel like. I'm looking at Warner at a tight end right there. I like that crossing route. Those were always very, very good routes. Okay. Ball moves through the air a little slow, but felt pretty good. It feels very similar to, to the last game so far. We'll try to get in some different throwing situations, see, uh, see what feels different and so on. A little bit of a loft. He catches that. That was a new animation. I think that was a new one. Getting two feet down or whatever. I don't know in this game if it's one foot or two. Getting to the shotgun. I just really want to check out the passing. See all the different animations and so on. Even the quarterbacks apparently got a little bit of a rework in how they perform around traffic and the likes. All right, I'm going to run with it. I put down the trigger. Oh, Cunningham gets annihilated at the first down marker, but he gets it. Putting an owl out there for the team. Corner strike. Let's try to fade to the corner again. If they're open, that is. Oh! He puts the ball on the ground. I went to go throw it while we were getting hit. Well, that is that. Uh, they get the ball back. Unfortunately, that is the end of our look at the, the passing animations for a bit. All right, Cleveland's got a 3-0 lead on us we'll play through the half and then i'm gonna go check out the menus in the franchise mode just to see what they look like since this is a first look video look at that past deflection that looked pretty good i think a lot of what you're gonna feel in terms of the improvements were under the hood in terms of gameplay and the animations um obviously that's what their their focus was they have a really good franchise mode set but it's just a matter of getting the difficulty on the AI up and getting that gameplay down. Oh, touchdown. A nice pass by the AI caught in traffic too. We had somebody on him, but it just was not enough. So again, I'm out of practice. I haven't played Axis in a bit, but the fact that the AI just went 10-0 on me is a, is a better situation than what we had last time. Some of the elite players might be grimacing if they if they play this game a lot, but uh, hey, it is what it is. We're doing a first look video, okay? Okay. All right, let's try some more passing, and then we'll get the run game going once again. Looking at you, Moody. Looking at you. Oh, off the back foot. Not a great pass. We got a flag. I'm going to guess holding. Penalty against the offense. There we go. All right, let's get a run. Let's get a run going. Halfback misdirection. We've been throwing the ball nonstop. It feels like he's only two for two. Really? <laughs> no, nah, we've thrown. What the heck is going on there? And that is the end of the first half. I want. I want a little bit more on offense. I want to. I want to check this out just a little bit more. Try to score a touchdown. While we're at it, let's try out some of this motion situation. So we got the, what, what, uh, what are they running? They're running out, okay. So we're gonna move our tight end to the left. How do I do this? We make you go here? All right, oh, accept. All right, so there we go. Now they're gonna move, we got motion going on. Nice, I like it, that is new. We got hot routes, which I believe were there. Or actually, maybe they weren't. I'm not sure. So we'll have that tight in it and go for a hot route there. This is an awful looking play. Wide open. Catch that, please. Yep. Oh, oh, he breaks away. Let's go. Touchdown, Warner. Look at that. Easy peasy. A little bit of an end zone dance. I always like the end zone dances they have in this game. I thought they're pretty good. And that's that. Uh, but yeah, there's there's a quick look at the gameplay right now. We're going to go check out some of the rest of the menu. And I'll see you in a quick second. So setting up the franchise mode. Again, you get the American, which I guess is like the NFL. And then the tier system, which is the classic Axis uh, experience where you move up the different levels as you uh, win and so on. Uh, but we'll do the American 
And how do I advance? Okay, there we go. So you can make your own teams, uh, and you can put them in here, and you can move teams around, and so on, even with the created teams within the game. But there's a look at that. I'm just going to start the franchise, and we'll go on from there. So here's the menu. It's looking pretty similar. Uh, I don't. I mean, they didn't announce that they changed too much with the franchise mode, but it's pretty in-depth already. It's, and it's pretty good, I think, for people who would like to play coaching-wise. Uh, if, you, if you're not into the gameplay on the field, you can do some coaching and, and, and like that. But yeah, otherwise, this all looks pretty similar. I don't see too much of a change there. Uh, still no replay within the game, so maybe eventually, as we move forward, they can put that on. Uh, but yeah, that was just a quick look at the gameplay. Hope you enjoyed that. And uh, it looks like you can still do the creative teams, which is always good. And I'm sure uh, we'll start seeing some interesting teams and, you know, realistic or real life teams all around uh, Axis football soon enough. But hope you enjoyed that quick look. It was just a, a simple thing. Just wanted to get in on the game. The lighting definitely looks a little better. I can tell there's been improvements to the on-field gameplay. Uh, it, it's it's familiar still. It still feels like Axis football. If you played a previous one, still feels like Axis football. But there's a lot more animations on the field. Um, and uh, I mean, the, the AI was beating us. So I'm, if I get a little bit more practice in with the game, maybe I'd find ways to still get past the AI. We saw that long long ball, which was sort of an issue in the previous ones. Or if you kind of hung around, uh, you'd be able to throw it deep. But other than that, it's it's fun. I mean, it is when you come into this, you know, it's a it's a small team working on it. You have to know what you're getting into and you can have fun with this game if you look past some of that stuff. So hope you all have a great day. Thank you so much. Till next time. Peace out.